Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to practically demonstrate one of the Selenium WebDriver commands that is move to element command. So what is the purpose of this command? Let me explain. For example, you want to move your mouse cursor over to a particular UI element. Then we have to use this command guys. Move to element command will simulate the mouse movement to the required UI element. Let's say I want to move my mouse cursor over to this blocks option. For that, we need to use this command in our Selenium automation code that is move to element command. Now let me practically show you the same. Here already some sample automation code is written for opening the Chrome browser, for maximizing it, and then opening the application URL like this. Once the application URL is open in this Chrome browser like this, now I want to move my, I want to move my mouse over to the which option? Let's say I want to move my mouse over to this blocks option. Blocks option. You can move your mouse to any option, guys. Uh, in this example, I am going to move my mouse over to blocks option. Which command we have to use for that, guys? We have to use this command known as move to element command. So in order to use this uh, move to element command, first of all, we need to create an object for actions class. We need to first create an object for the actions class like this. Actions actions is equal to new actions. Okay, once you create an object for the actions class for the mouse and actions and say select import this actions from Selenium, this constructor cannot be empty. So for the mouse, you see, we need to pass the driver. Driver object we need to pass to this actions constructor. So once the object is created for this actions class using the object reference, we need to call this command that is move to element command. Actions dot move to element command like this. So to which element we need to move the mouse cursor that element, that web element details we have to provide here, right? So I want to move my mouse cursor onto this blocks menu option. For that, I need to inspect this blocks menu and I need to create a web element for this blocks option. So this is HTML code of this blocks guys. Uh, it has some ID. I'll copy this ID attribute value and I'll create a web element here. Anywhere you can create just before driver.find element by dot ID. This is the web element of that blocks menu option. So the return type of this find element is web element. So blocks menu for the mouse create local variable. This is a web element. Copy this web element that is blocks web element, blocks menu web element. Copy this and put it inside the move to element command. So move to element command will move the mouse cursor to this blocks menu. So this is not the end guys. Actions dot move to element. After this, in order in order for this uh, mouse uh, movements to happen successfully, this command is okay guys. But along with this command, you have to say build.perform. If you don't provide this build.perform at the end of this move to element, this mouse movements will not happen guys. Not only move to element command guys. In future, if you use, if you use any other commands of this actions class, at the end you need to pass this build.perform. Then only this move to element command will really work. Without this build.perform, this move to element command will not work guys. So better to provide build.perform at the end of the, the move to element command. Fine, now let's run this code. So right click, run as Java application. So I will not be moving my mouse guys, okay? I left my mouse. You can see that automatically the mouse will move on to that blocks menu option. You see, I didn't move my mouse. The mouse automatically went to the blocks menu. As you can see that blocks menu option is over with the mouse. That's the reason you are seeing all the options of that blocks menu. Fine. So guys, this is how we need to use move to element command of actions class of Selenium web driver. Hope you understood this command guys. So that's it guys. Thank you all. Bye.